beautiful children in the world. This is your Father in Heaven speaking with you now. The I Am of all creation, the one who created you, who thought you into being, who placed you on the earth at this time. Thank you for listening to my words and to the nations. Thank you for listening to me, to my Holy Spirit. I promise to teach you, instruct you, lead you and guide you, my child, right until the end the very last day of your life upon the earth. Come to me this day, my child. Bow your knee before my Son, your Lord and Saviour, Jesus Christ. Give unto him your whole self. Repent of your sins. Confess that you are a sinner in need of a Saviour. Through my Son's holy blood you will be forgiven. You will be washed white as snow. You will walk into paradise at life's end. If you love him, my child, if you give your life to him, if you follow his ways, if you read his holy words, if you read my holy Bible, if you love me with your whole heart and soul, mind and strength. Come to me this day, my children. Lay all your heavy burdens down. I promise to carry them for you. Come step into my presence. Take another step closer to my ways. Let go of all distractions and rest. Breathe. Relax. My child, I'd like to take you on a journey today. One you have never been on before. A journey into my heavenly realm, my heavenly kingdom, to show you all that awaits you at life's end. My child, there is only death for the physical self. Your spirit does not die. Your spirit returns to me. And if you pass through my judgment, if you are not separated from your God at life's end because of willful sin and disobedience and rejection of my Holy Son, you will walk in paradise with me, with your God. I will be your light, the light that governs your day. You will feel my presence, you will hear my voice such as this. You will be free, free to dance, free to soar. My child, I want for every person on the earth to be born again to be saved unto paradise. This is my heart's desire. The desire of your God is that mankind would choose him, would choose me, to love me willfully. Not because I force you, my children, but because you love me, you want to love me. You are thankful for all I have done for you. My children, I want to enter into a relationship with you this day. I want to walk with you like I did with my very first creation. I want to speak with you one on one, to lead and guide you, to protect you, to care for you, to fill you with my glory, to show you how to walk in my presence, my love each day to be consumed by the glory of your God. I wish to take away all fear, all anxiety, all depression. I wish to replace all fear with joy and hope and life abundantly. Through my Holy Son you can have life. You can live the life that I planned for you, the life I intended for your soul. Come to me this day, my child. Reach out your hand and place it in mine, and together we will fly. I see myself in the heavenly realm. I see myself with my Lord and Saviour Jesus Christ by my side. He is glorious to behold. I hold his hand. And he fills me with warmth, with love, with acceptance. I am his and he is mine. 
He smiles at me and I smile. He delights in me as I delight in him. All I want is to be with him. He is so beautiful, so reassuring. I bow at his feet, never wanting to stand. I kiss his feet. I weep, so in love with him. Tears of joy. Oh Lord, you are my life. You are my love. My bridegroom God. I bow before you night and day. Kalaraba has given to you all of my heart, for you are worthy. You alone are worthy. My precious bride, I love you. I adore you. I died for you. Come with me this day, my child. I wish to walk with you in paradise. I wish to show you something new, something you have never seen before. I stand before my Lord, head bowed. He kisses my forehead, and I feel so loved. He places his hand in mine. Suddenly, Kapasha, we are walking on streets of gold. There is gold all around me. It is beautiful. I see people moving about. They are in their glorified body. They are not in physical form yet I recognize them I can see their face hands, feet but they are in spirit they move like the wind I see a river, a lot of Ashiki flowing beside us. I see buildings, but they look like castles. Everything looks like a castle. Kamokoti, I see flowers. The fragrance in the air is beautiful to every part of my being. I feel like how my whole body is breathing in the atmosphere the fragrance of heaven. Kopayana Haleri, my Lord, gives me a cup, a golden cup, Kiriya filled with wine, red wine. He has a cup. He wraps his arm around mine. Kashaka Takashi, we embrace with our cups and then we drink. Together as one. My child, you have been saved by the blood of my sacrifice. You drank from the cup. You were forgiven of all your sins. Therefore, you are cleansed in my sight. As we drink, I see an image of a lamb. I am with the Messiah, the Holy Lamb of God. And in this vision, I see the Lamb being slain, killed by man, trampled, murdered, destroyed. Korapatara Lady and my child, I lay down my life for you. So that you can experience paradise, eternal life with me. 
I am the Holy Lamb who was slain. I am the Messiah. Hara higa hara 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 the key and the Lion of Judah, your Redeemer, your King. Hara hara bashi ra ki ya na hara bahe ra hara bashi ki ko ro bato ro bashi ki ya haleri ya na kati. The Lamb, bashi ki ti ki ya hara hara bashi ka shoko tora kris covered in blood. Hara hara then I looked to my Lord. And he is covered in blood. All of a sudden, he looks as he did on the cross. Beyond recognition. His skin torn. Crown of thorns on his head. The blood pours to the ground. My Lord, you died for me. You went through all this pain so that I could stand with you this day. I fall to my knees. I kiss his feet. There is blood everywhere. My child, I would do it all again. I would die again for you, for mankind, because I love you all so much. And I want for every soul to be saved unto my kingdom. I want for every soul to return unto me in paradise. My Lord, I thank you for your death. I thank you for your resurrection. I praise you for your ascension into heaven. I thank you for forgiving me of all my sins and washing me in your holy blood. I look up and my Lord is robed in white. He is beautiful again, beautiful in my sight. He is pure, he is holy, he is radiant. He beckons me to stand. I stand, and as I stand, I feel like I'm in the most beautiful gown. A golden gown. I feel like a princess before him this day. I look beautiful in his sight. And I smile. My Lord, my Savior, my God and my King. I bow before you this day, so in love. Kaleri Baba Hashiki, my beautiful bride, come walk with me through the gardens of paradise. Kaleri Anna, he reaches down and picks the most beautiful flower and hands it to me. Kaleri Hashiki, I smile, so in love, so happy, so free. As I look, Aleri, everywhere that I can see are beautiful flowers. Some flowers I recognize from the earth. Some are new, different. I see every color, millions and millions of different colors. A thousand fragrances fill my soul. I cannot stop smiling. This place is so beautiful. Come, my child, let us lie down in this heavenly meadow. Let us relax for just a moment. We lie down in the softest grass. We look up towards the heavens. Aleria, the atmosphere, Kasha Kotoko Ishiana Hashikata, is so filled with glory. Lerio no Koko Patare, my children. Aleri, this is your Father in heaven speaking with you now, the I am of all creation. Akasha Katakal, I am with you. I am your Father. You can always hear my voice, my children. You can always talk to me. Oh, Father in heaven, thank you for this beautiful day in paradise. Thank you for showing me your heavenly meadow. 
Alehaya Hasha Kakarkiya had the gardens of paradise. Thank you, Kaisha Nahora, for allowing your world, your creation, to see such as this this day. I pray every person listening to this heavenly word experiences a touch of your glory, a touch of your presence, your love. My children, it delights my heart to see you as this. Come out here, it is my pleasure to show you paradise. This is where you will come at life's end. This is not a dream. This is not imagination or a fantasy. I am showing you all that is to come so that you can tell the world. So that you can reveal heaven on earth. I see the colors in the atmosphere. Alehashikitiki are so beautiful. It is like uh, the light of heaven shining on everything. The presence of God is in everything. There is no sin, there is no hatred or despair or grief. There is only joy eternal joy and love and peace. Everything looks clean, pure, holy. Everything is perfect, unblemished, spotless and free. Lots of people walking around enjoying the garden breathing in the fragrance, the fragrance of heaven. My child, when you return to the earth, it will be as if you are walking in the garden of paradise every day. Supernaturally, I will manifest heaven on earth for you. And you will feel like you are here as you walk through your garden on the earth you will feel like you are in paradise the fragrances will fill you the colors the glory your eyes will be opened you will see things you have never seen before on your earth I will manifest heaven on earth for you, my child, because I love you. and I want you to experience good things. You will be filled with such peace from this day forward. You will feel your Lord's hand in yours as you walk. You will hear my voice. I am increasing my glory upon you burning fire glory in your belly. You will be aware of my reality, night and day. I will be in your dreams. Everything you do will reflect a part of heaven. Everything you see and hear, taste and touch. You are releasing heaven on earth at this time. Through your temple, my spirit pours out glory. Kopot and my glory will cover the earth. Allah the knowledge of the glory of God. Alhadahasha will be released. My child, Hashaka, what are you seeing at this time? My Lord, I see myself, Allahadah, standing on the steps of a temple. I don't know if it's a temple on the earth or a temple in heaven. Allah your temple, but I see myself on the steps with my sister in Christ, the one chosen to release these words with me to the nations each day. We stand together and we are holding up a holy Bible. Allah hash to the people, beckoning them to read. I see as a multitude of people listening. They are listening, not to our words, but to your words being released through us. 
they come each day to listen, to listen to your words. Your presence is falling upon them as they listen. Your peace, your glory, your love. They fall to their knees in worship and praise. Lord of my child, every person who listens to these words will feel a touch of my presence, my glory. Divine order will fall upon their lives. I will speak to them one on one through these words. I will minister to their souls. I will change and transform and renew their lives. Every single person will have an experience of their God. Kapati, these words are living and active sharper than a double-edged sword, just like in my Holy Bible. I'm renewing minds, changing hearts, teaching, correcting, rebuking, healing. As people listen to these words, they will be healed in their bodies, mind, body and spirit. Heavenly Father, I ask that you help us on this journey, that you lead and guide us on this path. Help us to speak only words of truth and righteousness and love in your name for your honor and glory. We do not desire any attention for this Karahash journey, Kashaka from man. We do not need anyone to know our names or who we are. This is not our journey, this is your journey. These are not our words, these are your words. May you get all the glory and praise and honor in Jesus' name. We lay down our lives before you, our Kashaka Titiki, to preach your words to the nations. We pray for a multitude of souls to be saved unto the kingdom of heaven, through these words. My children, you are my two witnesses on the earth, two women with the wind in their wings, and you hold the holy scroll, Pashikiti, the little scroll in your hands, or you are releasing a 1260 day message and a 2.2 million word message for me. You are my promise too. Do not worry what the world thinks. Remember that they will reject and despise you and laugh and mock you. But there will be some who have ears to hear. Many will be called to help you to respond to these words, to release these words to the nations. Many will help you. Do not worry, do not fear. You are safe, my children. I have put you in a safe dwelling place so that the world cannot hurt you. Do not worry. All things are under my will and control at this time. I am watching over you. I am protecting you and keeping you both safe. You will finish the task before you and many will come to salvation. See us walking down the steps of the temple. To the people. I see us handing out copies and copies and copies of your book. Your words to the nations. I see them reading and being changed. I see you speaking to each individual person one on one through your words. This is our job, simply to release your words. And I thank you for the honor and blessing of this task, this calling. Thank you for choosing us, my Lord. We will not let you down, we will not falter. We give you our life this day now and forever. Amen.